what is up party people welcome back to my channel i feel like i'm on a roll making videos putting them up and you guys watching them <laughs> anyway today i have another thread up unboxing it's actually massive <laughs> all right thread up unboxing so i uh, opened it up already. Ooh, something fell out. Here's my little uh, receipt. So this is the mixed or DIY denim 30 pound box. I paid $48 for this box and there's just a bunch of denim in here. <laughs> um, I actually, this has been sitting around for like a week actually. Um, you know, it's Q4. Life gets busy. What is this? JC Penny and Thread Up. Visit us in real life. Try before you buy. In Salt Lake, where I live. Austin, Texas, Nashville, Atlanta, Washington, DC. Fun. Cool. Maybe I'll have to try it at a JC Penny. It looks like I'll put that right here. But I'm gonna scoot over a little. So we can get into this box. There's just a big piece of the polka dot wrapping paper on the top. Holy crap. Let's just get into it. Okay, so first pair of denim. Looks like maybe it's men's paper, denim, and cloth. I only say that because it says it's a 3630. I've seen this brand out in the wild. Let me lose that, that's gonna get awkward. But I don't know where it's from, so this will force me to kind of figure that out. Made in Pakistan, it has a style number, date of manufacturing, March 2012. Uh, anyway, sorry, <laughs> just reading the facts about it. This is what they look like. They're kind of a straight leg, here's what the pockets look like and they're not wrinkly they just are they're meant to look wrinkly I guess I guess maybe they're a little bit wrinkly but they're not that bad anyway there's the first pair okie doke second pair is this pinky purpley color uh, it's called replay I think yeah this says replay right there too. Never heard of this brand. Uh, it's a 2734. 27 waist, 34 inseam. If that's the case, these will actually fit me. Ooh, they're button fly. I like that. Uh, <laughs> then it has this weird little stitch there. I don't know if... Yeah, I've never heard of this brand. Let me know of the brands. Like, I'm sure I'll find a lot of new brands to me in this box. If I say I haven't found them before and you've heard of them before, let me know in the district, the, not in the description box, cause you can't type there, <laughs> but the comments. Um, I don't know, these are kind of cool. Actually, I like the color of these. Ooh, they have an embroidered R on the back. I don't know, I guess we'll see. Uh, when I do some research, because I have not done any research on any of these, by the way. Ooh, this looks fun. Ooh, it's a, I don't know why I thought that I would be getting jeans, but this is a vest. It's a stripe vest, and it's from Lauren, Ralph Lauren, or wait, <laughs> technically yes, but Lauren Jeans Company, size XL. Ooh, I plan on recording a couple more videos after this one. Maybe I'll wear this one in my next video because I just put this on over a black shirt, which I love. By the way, this is a vintage Pendleton men's wool shirt. Uh, and I found it at the bins and I love it. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to put this, uh, let's see, extra large. Sorry, I'm, I'm a little distracted, a little bit excited. I'm gonna put this over here to wear in my next video. Next up, we got some orange. 
Orange, do you glad you watched this video? I was trying to read it. Uh, looks like it's Fire Los Angeles. It's really hard to read. Size seven, just guineas. Uh, I've never picked this brand up to resell. I'm confused on what's going on here <laughs> on the legs. Um, I've never picked this brand up to resell. Um, it's like a Sherbert orange color. I don't really know if it resells well or not, but I guess we're gonna find out, aren't we? Okay, next we'll go, ooh, it looks like I grabbed two. And they're shorts, we're headed out of short season, but here we go, we got Morona, which is Target, uh, size 14, which is a decent size. Just some shorty shorts. And these will actually be great for um, like auctions in my eBay store. Maybe it will bring some people into my store. Maybe I'll keep these until summer rolls around again. Maybe I'll try to sell them for like two weeks on auction. If they don't sell, then, you know, I don't know. The next pair of shorts are Old Navy. So this is like the same thing. What is that? The Flirt. This is a size six. Just dark wash shorts. Cool. And I'm not like paying super attention to see like if there's any damage, which I probably should because it's a DIY, which means there might be damage on these. Like this one, I can tell now it might just need a wash, but like these spots here. Anyway, this one, ooh, I've never heard of this one. It's Lincoln Outfitter, size 14. Pink shorts. These are really cool. They kind of remind me of like a vintage vibe. Um, they're more Bermuda. Oh, geez, these are really dirty. Okay, now I see what they're... I'll see what they're talking about, but I'm going to wash them. But I like how they have this rolled hem. And sorry, I was just staring at more, more uh, dirt stuff on the back. Anyway, those are those. Next up, we have Hippie. <laughs> That's what it says. Hippie, size 10. Haven't heard of this brand, I don't think. This one I'm already seeing. See, now that I said that, I'm not really paying attention. Now I'm starting to poke out some flaws. Um, anyway, these look like they're uh, boot cut uh, pants. They have flat pockets with some embroidery. Again, I haven't heard of this brand. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's got a big hole on the back. So that's nice. Okay, so these I'm going to put in a separate pile because that hole is like on the back of the thigh. Nobody's going to buy that. <laughs> Maybe I'll convert them to shorts. Maybe that'll be a DIY project. Ooh. <laughs> what is this? Universal Threads. This is the Target brand. Uh, 12 slash 31 regular mid-rise jegging, which everyone loves jeggings, right? I just bought my boyfriend some jegging, jeggings. <laughs> from the bins. They're pants just like this. They just, they're American Eagle and they're like the super duper stretch, whatever. And he is like, that was the door, obsessed. Like maybe go on Poshmark, buy him some more. He's like, how did I live before jeggings? Anyway, I don't know, I'm sorry. Side note there, but Target brand, which is fine. Uh, ooh, some Levi's, 505s, 505s, it doesn't really say what size they are, let's see, 11, let's see, regular fit, straight leg, 11 junior L, I might try these on, actually, let me button this. Because I'm trying to find a new style of jeans. Like I, my go-to of jeans are black skinny jeans. 
and for me if you don't know I'm I'm going off on a side note again but I'm sorry <laughs> I'm 5'10 so I'm really tall uh, and most of my tallness is from my legs and so pants generally don't fit me um, but I found these look they're not black they're a dark wash they're actually even a boot cut and they fit and they're from Express and I thrifted them for $4. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm trying to find, get out of my comfort zone of black skinny jeans. Maybe I'll try these on. I'm going to put these over there. Ooh, kids. I don't love selling kids. Okay, so this is the Sonoma boot cut. Size 7. My kids are a little bit bigger than a size 7 now. But these are just a boot cut jean again this could be an auction item to bring some traffic to my store on ebay Ooh, there's a hair there and some lint okay next i see this which if you don't know what that is it's american eagle la 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 okay uh sometimes on the inside they'll tell you like what the style is this one does not tell me now i'm just trying to find the size okay here we go size four and these are just cute little shorts we have the slit back pockets just some shorts Ooh, a shirt or something ellen tracy size us large this is something I usually don't pick up in the wild, but I would wear this with my black skinny jeans. <laughs> uh, it's got the tab sleeve, which I actually appreciate because I have long arms and nothing fits my limbs. So Ellen Tracy has this zip in the front. It's just a chambray tunic shirt. Okay, next up. Oop, oop, oop. Chico's Platinum, size 2, which I think is a large. I haven't done Chico's in a long time. I'm not sure. Uh, here's the tag. I will look it up. I do like the pockets on these. Look, they have like studs here and embroidery. Ooh, it's like metallic. <laughs> I wish they would have buttoned, at least the buttons, though. I guess they weren't planning on me filming a video, but this is like a straight leg. Yeah, looks like a straight leg to me. Jeans, very nice to regular. Okay. What are you? Vigas Studio, the Hampton boot. Again, I see this brand in the wild and I don't pick it up. Uh, it's a size three slash four or 27. And then there it is. These actually feel really nice. They feel comfortable. Ooh, what is going on here? It looks like they've been hemmed. Yeah, they have. So, interesting. I like the pockets on these ones. Um, I'm going to look this up. Uh, I'll either list them and mention that they've been hemmed and put the inseam or I probably just won't list them at all. But they feel comfy, but the bottoms are a little, you know, distressy. Okay, next up, J. Crew. Very cool. Uh, Trying to find a size here. Uh-oh, I'm not seeing one. Uh, I'm not sure. J. Crew. They're probably a 12 or a 14. I'm not sure, but they're a, like a high-waisted capri pants. And that's about it. I wonder if it has a style number. Let's just 
looking at the tag. No, it doesn't even have a style number. Weird. I don't know. I'll have to look into this. And let's see. Next, we have another pair of shorts. This is Massimo, size six. Massimo is Target. I like the print. Ew. It's like there's big, you know what's so funny when I saw this? These circles, it reminded me of like um, water stains on a coffee table from your glass or your coffee or whatever. That's just what it reminded me of. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, let's keep going. Uh, Tommy Hilfiger. Size. Size. Hmm. I don't see right off the bat, but they're a smaller size. Tommy Hill figure, does that say? No, that just says H. Okay, let me button this up. They're dark wash. They're probably a six or an eight. Looks like they're a boot cut. That's what they look like there. They're really stretchy. They feel comfy. Okay. Next, I see something new with tags. HD jeans. They have a fray hem, which looks cool. Let's see. Whoa, I almost hit myself. Oh, it's like a, it's a Chinese or Japanese brands. Chinese. Anyways, but it has, they're cool though. They have, oh my heck, what is, <gasps> what? These are trash. All right, so you know how I've been button up the <laughs> buttons. Look, these are like sewn shut. There's no hole for those to go into. What in the world? <laughs> They're kind of cool. I wish that, I don't know, do I cut it? Do I cut it to make sure? They're, they just say size small. I'm gonna put these over there with the other damaged pants and see what I can do with these. I have no idea. Another pair of kids pants, True Craft Flex Slim 4T. I don't even know what this is. Never heard of it. Just little kids, slim pants. I wonder if these will fit my knees. I don't know if she's that big actually anyway those are those okay so looks like we have some more Levi's these are mid rise skinny size 4 dark wash there's the rear there. It looks like this has some wear to it, but that's not a big deal. Not a big deal at all. Okay. These are loft, uh, size six modern boot. I don't usually buy loft again, but that's fine. Uh, these ones do have a little bit of wear on the hem here. I don't know. We'll see. And then the rear just looks like this. Okay. Next up, our purple pants. How cool would this be with this? I'm like so fall right now. These are American Eagle. See, this is the kind that he likes. Is this super stretch or whatever? Uh, these are a size 14 regular. Cause look at how much they stretch. They feel like you're wearing pajamas. Anyway, so here's purple. Oh, sad. 
it has like this line here. I don't know, maybe I can still, I'll just auction them or something. It has another line at the bottom too. So they're skinnies. I wish these were my size. I would wear these. Anyway, those are those. Another pair of shorts. I don't know how to say this. Woo, I just messed with my hairdo. How do you say that? I want to say Aria. Like from Game of Thrones. Aria jeans. These are Bermudas. Um, they're supposed to be rolled up. Hold on, let me... There, like this, distressed. Bermuda shorts with fancy pockets. Woo! Size 15, 16, if I didn't say that already. Hokey dokey. <gasps> I might have to have these. We'll see. Levi's premium quality clothing. They're a button fly. They're a 501. Let's see what size are you. They're a 28. They might fit me. They just might. I really want a pair of these Levi's. They're just so flattering on your butt, to be honest. Uh, it looks like somebody did this themselves, which is fine better than what I could do. I'm going to try these on. Okay, next. I think this is Bygos again. Yep, Bygos Hampton boot. What was the last one we had? I feel like it was something very similar to this Hampton boot. This one is a size 3 slash 4, 27. I don't remember what the other one was. Oh, you know what? This is the one that had, was it? Did I throw it over here? Sorry. No, it was not. Hmm. There was a, I think there was something wrong with it though, but here we go. Um, oh, it was hemmed. Yeah, this one's not hemmed. It does have a little bit of something, something going on right here. But these are the comfy ones. I just remember because the way that they feel, they feel like a comfy pair of jeans. So there's those ones. Ooh, hello. These are bright pink. Very bright pink. Okay. Okay. So these are Amber Kami and Fitch. Size 8 regular. Really bright pink pants. Boop, boop, boop. Okay. And they're skinnies. I guess that's all you really need to know. So, <laughs> there's that one. Ooh, look at this. Hey, hey, what are you? Old school. Never heard of it. <laughs> Old school. Oh, these are kind of cool. They're a size 36, so they're men's. Hmm. They're just a wide leg. Or a straight leg, I guess, for men. This is a hair or a string that I just need to trim. Look at these pockets. That's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I don't really know how much these will go for, but we shall find out when we do the research. My arms are getting tired. Looks like I only have a couple left. Let's see, these are pink pants. Oh, these are also Target Cat and Jack Jeggings. So these are like bigger kids, right? Size 16, because this is not a size 16, like in women's. But these are fun. They have zips in the front, another pink pant. <laughs> Skinny. It looks like somebody wore them <laughs> and then just sent them to thread up with all these lines here. Or maybe they just tried them on. Who knows? It looks like they're probably a see-through kind of pant. I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Okay. So here's a pair of Joe's jeans, which doesn't sell great for me, 
but whatever joe's jeans these are a size 32 they're the skinny ankle i like the Ooh, they're distressed okay they're distressed uh they are stretchy they feel like the whole jeggings deal there's the joe's symbol Ooh, they have some issues in the crotch that's unfortunate this is a brand i've actually heard of uh but these are gonna have to be in the r.i.p pile and these are the last things that i have in my box so these are hot kiss high rise shorty i was re reading that backwards so hopefully i read it right and these are just like the american eagle high rise shorties these pockets have like the cute lace pockets hanging out they're a size 18. these are really cute i would wear these if these are my size all righty then so that's the end of my box my big old box is empty now and what did i pay for that what did i say actually i had credits again i don't really pay i mean kind of with my credits but 48 bucks okay i think i'll probably i'll get my 48 dollars back out of that and then some um there's not really any like if i keep those two levi's after i try them on worth it right uh <laughs> anyways tell me what you thought about this box i don't down below and uh we'll see you guys in my next video but don't forget to stay weird bye guys